Hey guys, I'm LB. We are back playing Thinking with Time Machine. This is episode one, the second episode. If you're looking for the first episode, that would be episode zero. Last episode, the Borealis crashed in here and we found out that the co-op bots deactivated GLaDOS or something. And uh, yeah, I went back and checked and yes, I did see Adlington play this. He is the person, not Arcus, Adlington. I often get them confused. And also, apparently I didn't- I didn't even notice when I walked in. Apparently I walked in right past this and just looked around everywhere but here. So yeah, this is how we get over here. And I guess that would be to get back, since, uh, yeah. So, let us proceed. And yes, there is no music apparently. I- I checked it out in, uh, in Adlington's videos, there's just no music. So, there's music on the title screen, but... And then there's music in that one spot there with the little, uh, record player, but there's not music anywhere else for some reason. Not even, like, normal music from the game. Which is strange. I thought I heard a portal fire sound, but maybe that was just the door closing. Wow, look at this BTS! That is some very nice BTS. Okay, short wall. This is... alarmingly familiar. But I don't know the solution. <laughs> Alright, let's think about this. Alright. We're gonna wanna pass something through here, right? Is this gonna spawn two cubes? Probably the easiest way to find out is... is just to do this. So we need to get a laser here. That's probably... yeah, it's probably definitely gonna spawn two cubes. Alright, so we do that, right? And this button... needs a cube in it. What? Oh, but then... Wait, really? What do we need the time machine for except to get over this wall? Is this wall the only thing we need the time machine for? Really? I mean, okay, we'll, we'll find out. Soon enough. Let's try it. So if we do this, right? Yeah, that seems to be it. it surely... It must be missing something. This, it can't be that simple. This wall is the only thing we need the time machine for? Really? Okay then. Why? Alright. That was kind of a... Uh... Unneeded puzzle, because we already know how to climb on ourselves to get over obstacles. Oh well. That is... frightening. Oh, and that's where we're going, too. <laughs> frightening is where we're going. Wait, we were going down before, and after the loading screen we were going up. Things are not making much sense. Is this just a dream? I don't think I noticed these little... remade ver- well... They wouldn't have to be remade, they're just... yeah. It's still neat. But it's really easy to do. More BTS. I wonder if it's the same BTS every time, and that's why it looks so good. Why, ah, hello there! Alright, so... where does this go? Ah, okay. Oh ho ho Oh, I see exactly what needs to happen. I 
think we could do it either way, but it would be a lot harder to do the timing if we did the recording down here, so... Let's just, uh... Head back up. And we will do it this way. So... We want to... Start recording. Drop these down there. And then we'll pick them up when we, uh, yeah. Alright, cubes in place. Alright, so, now we play. There's one. There's two. And there's three. Perfect. Alright. Save. I really hope that loading a save while a clone is active does not crash the game. I actually do not know. I do not want to find out. Whoa, did you see that? It's like... Oh my gosh! Look at that knock! Look at that, you don't even have to try! <laughs> That's what can't make fun of you! That's actually kinda nice, that they did that, because those things are notoriously difficult to put cubes in. Not can vouch for me in that. Let's see... We've got actually firing portals in this one, it seems. Fancy missions. Yep. I like how they put the portal symbol on there just to remind you that you actually have a portal gun, because I, I have forgotten. I will be honest, I have forgotten. Oh, this. This is bringing back memories. I remember this. really awkward without music, though. <laughs> I might... I might, like, get the Portal 2 soundtrack playing in the background or something after this episode. Alright, so let's look at this. Right, we have to play a game of catch with ourselves to keep it above the Fizzler. Ooh. Okay, so first things first, I want to find out... Oh, where are we... Okay, the button's up there, so we gotta do that first, but I wanna find out... Can we... Grab a cube from our clone without the clone having to let go? Start recording... Uh... Okay, I'm recording, good. I just didn't hear the sound for some reason. Okay, stop recording, and play. Oh, okay, well, that was easier said than done. I mean, easier done than said, actually. <laughs> I got that backwards. Alright, moment of truth. Let's, let's see. Well, actually, does this respawn? Let's find out. Yes, it does respawn. Thank you! Alright, so, let's figure out if we record, right? We're recording, and we'll just do this, right? And then, stop recording. Let's integrate this so it's in the same spot for the clone to pick it up. I don't know how specific it is, but you never know. And then play, can we grab it out of the hands of the clone? Hey, you can! That's good to know. Excellent. Well, I know what I'm doing. So. Let's take this. 
wait for our future self to grab it. We'll wait a good while, you know, just to be on the safe side. Actually, he doesn't really... We don't need to wait, because we can actually walk all the way over there. And, uh, yeah, not have to worry about that at all. Before we even play the recording. I'm still thinking in Talos Principle terms. Then we go all the way over here. And then press E. Hey, there you go, it recorded it. And... Just gotta be very careful not to fizzle it. And then E. Cool stuff. Okay, so it stopped recording. Good, good, good. Let's get back into position. And we'll hit play now. And now we just go over here and wait. So yeah, I am still very tired. My sleep schedule is still horribly messed up. But as you can see, our clone is arriving. Yes! Looks like it worked. Don't fizzle. Holy crap, that is really close to fizzling. Hey! We did... Did it, we did it, we did it! Awesome, good. What are these portal surfaces for? Just to speed up travel, I guess? Oh, <laughs> we could have sped up travel, that, that would have been useful. Eh, oh well, too late. Well, no, what will we even use that for? I guess if you did the clone on the inside instead of the outside, yeah. Oh wait, no wait! No, the clone could have sped up travel, what am I thinking? I am way over-confusing this. Oh. Oh! We gotta do this again. Sorry, the asbestos is getting to me again. It happens more when I'm tired. Alright, let's think about this. Should be as simple as just reversing the process, right? Let's record. Do that, we can instantly grab it. Because we'll have already been over there. Fire at will! Shortcut taken! Then... We'll do... this. Just put the cube here, and then we'll deal with it from there. Okay, stop recording. That's good enough. And... play. I wonder if we can play the same recording multiple times. Kinda funny, cause Nock played this before playing the Talos Principle, and I played the Talos Principle before playing this. Okay, good enough, good enough. So yeah, we- we played these games in opposite orders. I said Nock, right? What did- what did I think I said? I'm too tired to think straight, guys. <laughs> Thankfully these puzzles are easy enough that I don't really have to think straight. I can think sideways, zigzag, or, uh... Whoa! Apparently I can think nothing as well, because... Oh, this is reflective! What? How did I not notice that this is reflective? I don't think I've seen a reflective surface before. I mean, I have, but not in Portal 2's engine. That's kinda cool. I wonder if that is a... predetermined reflection map? Well, no, because... 
it's got the laser in it and everything, that is cool. So it is actually a real-time reflection map, nice. Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, we head down, the game loads, and then... Oh wait, I think we've seen the level on this loading screen already. And then we head up! That is really bizarre. Why would you do that? <laughs> Alright, portals, jumping on yourself. Oh, they- they did add new. Unless that was already in the game with co-op or something. I'm pretty sure that is new. Don't think you can jump on each other in co-op, really. But you can smash into each other to stop your flight. Alright, what's going on here? What? Or is this signage for this, or for this? Gosh, who even knows? And then there's- there's ant lines here, but who even knows why? Oh, and there's this button up there? Oh, goodness. Interesting. So if you start recording, it takes away your portals. They could have done it the same way in the Talos Principle where you have, like, ghost portals or something, but... Yeah, I guess it was just too tricky to program it that way. Oh well. But it is nice to know that I can clear my portals whenever I want without having to find a special hotkey for it. Oh my gosh, yes, Bestos. Actually, I helped my sister move into her dorm today in the, uh, the dust from unpacking stuff has gotten into my lungs. Oh, I didn't even see that! What the deal was this? What's that even for? One-way portal, but why? Why would I want to use that? And then there's... Wait, what? Are you seeing this? If I fire here, it does not light up. I fire here and it does. That is... Those are connected for some reason. That is a bug. <laughs> okay, let's actually get started, shall we? I need to press this button and I've been neglecting to do that this entire puzzle. Alright. We'll begin recording. Stand up. Jump, just in case. Stop recording. Playback. There we go. Whoa, I got like extra height from that. Whoa. Alright then. Oh, that's good to know that the ball can't escape. Will the ball stay on these buttons? Oh! These buttons are specially designed to not let balls stay on them. Unless you do that. <laughs> that works too. How do we- how are we gonna do that? That is a mystery to me right now. We might have to solve the mystery next episode, I don't know. Wait, what opens this? Does this open that? Oh no, we need it up there. Can we just hold it up there? Oh, we need the cube, certainly, right? Okay, so that is a possibility. Oh wait, does it stay? What? It stays? That's... bizarre. <coughs> you know what? We're gonna have to solve the mysteries of this next episode, so as always, thank you for watching, and if you hate the sound of my voice, 
a good bike. It's up to you. I will see you all in the next ep episode. That cubes is not really game. Really. Goodbye.